Hello my little juniors. I hope you all are doing fine. Kids, today I have come up with one more concept. That is tips on road safety. Now, let's see the following one. Kids, following are some rules to follow. That means these are the basic rules which you should know. So, let's see the first one. Know your signals. Second, stop, look and cross. Third, pay attention. That means listen. Fourth, don't run on roads. Fifth, always use sidewalks. Sixth, cross roads and pedestrian crossing. Seventh, never stick hands outside the vehicle. And eighth, Never cross road at bends. Kids, these are the very basic rules for your safety. Whenever you are going with your parents on road, do not run on road because it is very dangerous for you. You might be in danger because we have our vehicles going so fast on road. So it is not safe for you. Whenever you are crossing the roads, always ensure to look at first of your right side then left side and walk and cross the road only on zebra crossing path never ever go or try to run on the road now let's see the signs of the safety so it is very important to understand the signs let's look at the pillow picture these are a simple signs which you must have often seen on roads i will explain you few the one is school ahead that's a very important one which i feel because whenever vehicles are crossing on the road they are more aware that there might be a small tiny kids like you who might be out of the school or might be going to school to ensure that they have their speed slow down because it they cannot make you in they cannot put you in any danger right next is mm, no bicycles there are few roads where the bicycles are not at all allowed where they have a separate route for them road work ahead this board is been put up usually when there is a work going on on the roads that is where the, there is a lot of um you can see a lot of uh, vehicles running on the roads so this sign helps the other vehicle person to understand that they have to slow down their speed now let's see the next one look at the below picture kids and you tell me which one is the correct one there is a school boy who is trying to catch his bus who is running behind the bus and the other one is slowly getting down of the bus when the bus has completely stopped at the school the left picture that is the boy who is running behind the bus is not right because you might fall down and you might get hurt the second picture which shows that the child was has been waiting for the bus to stop and get down from the bus for the school so you should also take care kids let's see the next one this is a very important to understand kids many of you might feel what is harm to play on roads but it is not you should never play on road it is not safe for you but instead what can you do is you can play in a garden which is very much more safe right and you can enjoy your play as well now one more thing which you should do is or which you do not you should never listen music while walking on roads because if you put up your headphones on roads while walking through the streets it is very very dangerous because you cannot hear the sound or the horns given by the vehicles to make you aside it is not at all safe for you so you should never put your or never listen to music while walking on roads but instead you can walk on a footpath without listening music so you would be more safe 
try to understand kids it's a very very safety see what i said to you the child is running on the road where it is very very dangerous for that for the child he can get hurt but instead you can use a zebra crossing path to cross the roads because when a vehicles are passing by when you cross the zebra crossing it is much more visible for them to understand that someone is walking through the path so kids safety is simple as abc that means you should be always be careful thank you kids i hope you like this concept and make sure that you do follow all the rules on roads